Good morning, everyone. Welcome to the view, Russell's view. It's still, uh, since we face east, the sun is still, you know, beating down on us. But the sky looks really pretty, and uh, it feels like it's just going to be a glorious day. And I've just come back from uh, feeding and petting um, uh, Dexter, Chris's cat. Um, he's just the sweetest little kitty. Uh, I'm sure he's going to enrich Chris's life just tremendously. I'd like to give a, a, a big major shout out to Doug Menzman from uh, the office of City Councilman uh, Tom LeBond. This guy is Mr. Fixer and uh, you know, I uh, sent him a picture or something of the uh, unfenced lot along with, you know, my usual complaining, whining, whinging, however people want to pronounce that word now. And uh, within a couple of days, snap, snap, fence up. So, uh, thanks a lot, Doug. Uh, you really are Mr. Fix-It. And uh, I'm sure you probably saved more than one kid a broken arm or leg or a uh, cracked skull. So, uh, kudos. Kudos to Doug Menzman from the office of City Councilman, L.A. City Councilman Tom LaBonge. So, you know, I've, ri I've written to this guy about so many issues, and he's always written me back. He's always been polite. I mean, I could just go on and on about what a help this guy has been. And, you know, should ever the day come when he wants to run for public office, you know, I'd be first in line to give him my vote. First in line. <clears throat> that being said, I'm such a political animal because, you know, my father was a journalist. And the same with my uh, father-in-law, who was a big journalist here in L.A. So, um, and is a respected figure here in Los Angeles, as a matter of fact. But we're not going to throw any names around, because we're not like that. That's a very L.A. thing to do, and it's also a very Washington, D.C. kind of thing to do, to throw names around, like, oh, yes, uh, my friend in Ted Kennedy's office, uh, he was telling me blah, 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 or whatever. And all these power lawyers, and political action committees, and just the whole scene in Washington, D.C. It's a cold, cynical place. I'm so glad I escaped it from it. And the weather, huh. Oh, look. And I thought the cats were going to put on a show. But Maxwell never lets me film him doing anything cool. There's my little girl soaking up her son, playing with her toy. You go, girl. Okay, I'm not going to let this turn into a cat video. Neighbors doing um, little odd jobs around the apartment. That's nice, keeping the place up. So I'm seeing Dr. Epstein, my psychiatrist, um, at 2 o'clock. So I'm probably going to leave before noon. Because uh, Robin has forgotten what public transportation is like in this city. 
was, uh, uh, you know, I'll catch a subway at Union, and then from there I'm off to the races. Well, thanks for tuning in, and uh, I love you all. Hugs and kisses, and uh, Adam.